Hey Tubes, one of my uh, subscribers mentioned to me, he, he wondered why I didn't check this this magneto with a meter. You know, it was just easier for me at the time to use that, but he wanted me to show this. So uh, we got the Simpson 260 meter. That's that's pretty much the standard for the for the analog meters for years. So, you know, some of these are a little intimidating to some people, but there's really nothing to it. You uh, take the, you turn it on here, you see it says off. You just turn it on, any of them positions there, and we're going to go to uh, R times 100. What we're looking for is this mag's got to be between 6,000 ohms and 8,000, or 8,500 ohms. So anything between 6,000 and 8,500 8, would be good. So you take that and you put that at R times 100, and then you, you put your two needles together here and you, you zero your ohms in. I don't know if you can see that. i got a ratio behind the camera there. Okay, so you're zero right on in. zero. Okay. And then all you have to do is uh, check both ends. And I don't know if you see that. That's uh, looks like right around 80. So 80 times 100 is 8,000 ohms. It's, it's right, right in the ballpark there. So that, that shows you the, that mag is good. See if I take racers. Racers mag here. Can you see that, buddy? Yeah, I got it. We're not getting any reading at all. Nothing. Needle doesn't even move. Nothing. All right, so that's if you get the analog meter, you know. Some some of you guys have that, and you may may not know how to use it. You know, a little intimidating. But we also have the fluke here. Let me put this guy off to the side. Believe me, it's no fluke. <laughs> <laughs> Cut it out! You're killing me. You just turn it to the ohms. Can you see that? Yeah. So, right. oh, 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 Sorry, I had to stretch it out. Let me put it there for you. And then uh, just touch each end. And it comes up to 7.63, huh. which is good. 7.63K, uh, right? Yeah, if you see the K, I can't, can't take my hands over here, but the little K next to the ohm sign, that's 1,000. So, so that's 7,600? Right, or 7,630, huh. which, is, which is perfect, right where we want it. Perfect. So uh, I want to thank, uh, what's his name here? John Deere. John 19, Deere 1944 John Deere L. I want to thank him for the question. and. I hope that helped you out a little, buddy. I hope that helps you out with your Maytag. All right. All righty. Great work. All right. Thanks, Tubes.